All right, I figured to take a look at a few night vision mounts, various mounts, PVS-14. We've got the usual lineup. There's your Narodos, what everybody calls the Rhino arm. Take the standard bayonet type J arm, the hookup. A lot of play in it, a lot of wobble. The standard GI US issue. Now here's the same, basically, same rhino arm, but we've got the dovetail mount. I love that one. Works with the uh, Wilcox. Beats the hell out of the old setup there, as you can see the differences. And then we've got the AKA-2 from the Rodos, which has the dovetail adapter or the bayonet style. You can switch off. And a lot more adjustment in it. Came with the uh, universal shroud there. Much better than the bracket style. It hangs out, hangs off the helmet, you bitch. Newer version of the bracket. Just a few other random items. I got so much night vision crap, it's not funny. Nods, night observation devices. Uh, case, hard case, love that. The skull crushers are pretty much garbage. Unless you just want to go out for a little while. Uh, helmet covers. Sacrificial filters, another JR in the package. Bayonet. Wilcox Amber Filter, they're okay. Really don't like them. Myself. But, to make a long story short, go with the bayonet style only if you want to save a lot of money and have a lot of play. The dovetail setup, perfect. Rock solid. And if you get lucky, you can find in the middle and save a lot of money. Like the titanium belt from Norvos, but much cheaper. I'll have the standard hookup, nothing special, like the TATM, I believe, from Norvos. All the deltas you do is basically like that. But the universal shroud, you have the option three hole mount, Warcom, or one hole army, which I use. Hope this helps somebody.